guys, how's it going? My name is Mythic, and today I am showing you how to use a laptop of any time, of any kind, a Mac or Windows, old or not. Uh, how to use that as a second monitor? It is pretty interesting. There's no uh, cables that you need. All you need is a uh, connection to the uh, to your modem or to the internet or whatever. So let's get started. You're gonna come over here to uh, this uh, to Google. I'll have the link in the description. It's called Synergy uh, Project Synergy. You're gonna come up here, click download, and then click the sad face one because you don't want to pay for this probably. Continue. And now for whichever computer you uh, are using, so on my Windows one I'm going to download the 64-bit, but if you have 32-bit download that, and then on my Mac I'm going to download 10.9 or whatever version it is. So once you download it, it is going to pop up, and uh, let's see, I have to open it real quick. It's going to pop up, and uh, it, it's going to have the run wizard up right now so this is what you'll see when you have it all installed and you open it up I'm gonna click next uh, not interested uh, server uh, now this is where you uh, need to uh, do it on separate things or whatever so the the computer that is not the laptop the one that has the keyboard and mouse and that's the actual computer you're gonna click server 4 and then you're gonna click next and then I don't enable this and then finish and now if we go over here and click configure server uh, you'll see you won't see another window right here so we're gonna drag and drop that out and then so you're just gonna have this one screen right here you're gonna drag this one down place it inside you're gonna open that up and uh, now this is where you go to your Mac side so let me switch camera views over to there uh, mm, okay now now uh, once you're over on this side you're going to open up synergy again so let's click stop and then show now on this one uh, you're going to go into your preferences and whatever, oh, before you do this, the, uh, if you didn't see before, when this is installed in this computer uh, on your laptop, you're going to go do the same process, uh, not interested. Uh, and then on this one, you're going to click click Client Setup, and then click Continue, and then click Done. So now, uh, go into your settings or preferences, and then whatever your screen name is on here, we're going to go back over to the windows, is the screen name you put on here. So, mine was MacBook Pro. Book Pro. And then you click OK. And then, uh, you're pretty much good. You're going to, uh, oh, before we do anything else, you're going to come up here to the hotkeys, uh, tab. You're going to make a new key because sometimes when people install this, uh, you, they... Uh, have a problem to where they can't move their mouse over to their other screen, so we're going to fix that right now. You're going to go over to hotkeys, you're going to choose a key, and then you're going to come in here, you're going to choose action, and then you're going to select the lock cursor to screen toggle. And uh, what that does is, instead of, like, if you're, if you have this not uh, on, then your cursor will sometimes not go over to your other monitors, so this is how you would fix that. I'm gonna click OK. I already have it, so. And now OK again. And this is where uh, you need to uh, get the server IP. It's right here. It says IP address, and then it'll have your IP address right there. I'm gonna have it blurred out so people can't see my IP address. But uh, what you s the thing that's right there, the IP address you have there. You're going to go over to your Mac side and you're going to write the IP from your server into here. So the one that was on my Windows side is now typed into there. And uh, you're going to click start on your server one. And then you're going to click start on your Mac or the laptop. And then 
as you can see, uh, the windows closed on the laptop, and the I uh, minimized it on the windows. Uh, so now, when you uh, click your hotkey to unlock the screen, uh, you go over to this monitor like that, and it's pretty cool. So. I hope you guys en enjoyed this video. If it helped you out, please give me a like. Um, if you need any help, like you're having any trouble, comment, and I will get back to you as soon as I can. But uh, other than that, please uh, subscribe. Maybe follow me on Twitter if you want to. Uh, but uh, have a good day.